In this video, I will compare the AMD Ryzen 5 7530U and AMD Ryzen 7 5700U highlighting their differences, and then provide a conclusion to help you determine which one is the better choice. These both are processors from AMD but they have quite different in terms of their target audience, performance, and price. Let's look at them. This Ryzen 5 was released around 24 months after the release of the Ryzen 7 5700U. The AMD Ryzen 7 5700U has 8 cores and 16 threads, while the Ryzen 5 7530U has 6 cores and 12 threads. Having more cores and threads can lead to improved multitasking performance, faster processing of multi-threaded workloads, and better utilization of hardware resources. The AMD Ryzen 5 7530U has a base clock frequency of 2.0 GHz, while the AMD Ryzen 7 5700U has a base clock frequency of 1.8 GHz. Additionally, if you look at the boost clock frequency, the Ryzen 5 seems to have a greater frequency. The Ryzen 5 7530U has a slightly higher base clock speed, but the Ryzen 7 5700U higher core count can often compensate for this in most tasks. They both have the same L1 and L2 cache sizes of 64 kilobytes per core and 512 kilobytes per core, respectively. However, the L3 cache of the Ryzen 5 is 8 megabytes larger than that of the Ryzen 7. Additionally, if you look at memory size, the Ryzen 5 can support up to 64 gigabytes of RAM, whereas the Ryzen 7 can only support up to 32 gigabytes of RAM. Both of them support the same types of RAM, and they both have the same RAM frequency. Both of these processors have integrated graphics, but the Ryzen 5 7530U has a slightly higher graphics frequency, which might help with graphical tasks on your laptop. The Ryzen 5 supports ECC, so it can be used in critical systems like workstations and servers. Both of them support PCI version 3, but the number of lanes supported by the Ryzen 5 is greater than that of the Ryzen 7. So, more devices can be connected to the Ryzen 5. Without encountering thermal throttling or damage, the Ryzen 5 can reach up to 105 degrees Celsius, whereas the Ryzen 7 can only reach up to 95 degrees Celsius. TDP of this Ryzen 7 is configurable and ranging from 10 to 25 watt whereas Ryzen 5 has fixed TDP of 15 watt. If you look at benchmark comparison then for single core this Ryzen 5 seems to be slight better. For multitasking this Ryzen 7 might perform slightly better. My suggestion would be for multitasking this Ryzen 7 5700U might performs better. Due to its more number of cores. But for everyday tasks and prioritizing battery life this Ryzen 7530U is good option. Also this processor might be slightly cheaper than Ryzen 7 5700U. This much for today. If you like this video please like share and subscribe to the channel. Also click on bell icon so that you will not miss any update.